Are you going for your G2 or G test? Check out Truby Car's YouTube channel. Free driver education to help you ace your driving test. Truby Cars. Hello everyone, this is Mandeep from Truby Cars. Uh, we are in Oakville, Ontario. So if you're going for your uh, G2 driving test in Oakville, Ontario, or uh, you're looking for driving lessons, um, you know, driving school in Oakville, Ontario, uh, check out our uh, YouTube channel or our website uh, trubycars.ca. So in this video, we're going to drive around in uh, Oakville, Ontario and uh, cover some of the driving rules. So uh, let's get started. So going around parked cars, uh, you want to shoulder check, make sure it's clear and maintain a distance from parked vehicles. You need um, at least uh, one meter, so about uh, three feet. Stop sign, we are turning right, so right signal on, looking in my rear view mirror. And I'm going, to, uh, I'm going to do a complete stop here before the stop line. And this stop sign, it's a one-way stop sign, so that means the cross traffic does not stop. Now there's no pedestrian crossing and uh, we're just gonna move forward a little bit so we can see the traffic, no traffic. And uh, right shoulder check to make sure my blind spot is clear. Staying in the right hand lane. So when you're turning right, uh, make sure you keep your car in the right hand lane. Um, don't go too wide on your turns. Otherwise that's going to be um, a mistake in the driving test. Speed limit sign on the right hand side, um, so maximum 50. Another warning sign showing um, stop sign is coming up. And uh, from this stop sign, we are turning left. And this is always stop sign. So um, I'm looking in my rear view mirror as well. Nobody behind me. Complete stop here before the stop line. And uh, now we are good to go because we stopped before the van. And we were also on the right hand side. Okay, so on all way stop signs, if you stop first, you go first. And uh, if two vehicles uh, stop at the same time, then the vehicle on the right hand side gets the right of way. Um, intersections like this, just make sure you're scanning intersections. You can also cover your brake, uh, right? So you can uh, take your foot off from the gas pedal, cover your brake, uh, look both ways. Speed limit sign again on the right hand side showing uh, maximum 50 kilometers. And uh, from this stop sign, we are turning left. So left signal on, left shoulder check, going in the left turning lane. Complete stop here before the stop line. And uh, looks like we are we are all uh, we are the only one here, so we are good to go. Traffic lights are coming up, and uh, we're gonna be turning right on this traffic light. So right signal on, and uh, right now the light is red, so that means um, we have to come to a complete stop. So stop uh, before the stop line and uh, there's no, um, on this intersection, there's no prohibited sign. So that means we can turn right on a red light. So I'm just gonna slowly move forward so I can uh, check traffic. There is a car approaching. Um, so we're just gonna wait for this car to go first. Now I check my blind spot, so it looks clear and now we are good to go. Speed limit sign on the right hand side. We have a maximum 60 kilometers. Scanning intersection and um, on the next uh, traffic lights we are turning left so I'm going to um, signal mirror check shoulder check change lane to the left and uh, we're going to change one more lane to the left so on uh, this intersection here um, the traffic light is green and uh, the oncom oncoming traffic is uh, still a little bit far and there's no pedestrian crossing so that means we can complete our uh, left hand turn uh, speed limit sign on the right hand side maximum 50 kilometers uh, scanning intersections looking in my rear view mirror another yellow sign indicating a uh, pedestrian crosswalk is coming up uh, speed limit sign again so um, if you um, if you are in uh, Oakville Ontario looking for uh, driving lessons you're looking for uh, driving school we work with uh, many driving schools we work with the best driving schools so go to trubycars.ca to uh, book driving lessons and make sure you uh, subscribe to our uh, YouTube channel because we are uh, uploading new videos uh, every day. So scanning intersections, going around this parked car, I can signal, shoulder check. And uh, stop sign, we are turning right. So I have my right blinker on, right shoulder check, pulling back to the right hand side. And um, 
looks like uh, the intersection is clear no other vehicles pedestrians here so that means we are good to go traffic lights are coming up and uh, we're gonna be turning left um, on this traffic light uh, not on this intersection so we have to go from this intersection now I do a signal shoulder check and then we are turning left on uh, this intersection when you stop behind another another vehicle uh, make sure you leave about a car length uh, distance uh, you should be able to see the back wheels um, you know on the ground so now the light turns green and uh, this car is going in the intersection first uh, looks like um, the oncoming traffic they all are turning left and uh, there's no pedest no pedestrian crossing so that means we are good to go we turn into the left lane first and now we can change lane to the right hand side with a signal mirror check shoulder check move over to the right hand side next on traffic lights uh, we are turning right so i'm going to signal right right shoulder check and then we go into the right hand lane light is green um so uh, i'm slowing down because we we are good to go right shoulder check again and there's um left side uh, you want to check on the left hand side as well um okay so speed limit in this area is uh, maximum uh, 50 kilometers uh, warning sign on the um, right hand side for the playground and um, so you just want to be cautious for the kids and uh, traffic lights are coming up and uh, this traffic light we are uh, turning left so uh, left uh, signal on left shoulder check we go into the left hand uh, left turning lane uh, light is green so we go in the intersection no oncoming traffic and uh, there's no pedestrian crossing no oncoming traffic that you know that's going to interfere with us because the other car was uh, turning left so uh, going around parked vehicles you want to maintain distance uh, shoulder check when you're pulling out pulling back in make sure you're doing shoulder checks so like here shoulder check to the left move out and uh, shoulder check to the right go back to your side uh, very sharp right hand turn so i'm slowing down going around parked vehicle shoulder check make sure it's clear and um, just keep your speed a little bit slow here because right so the lanes are very narrow stop sign we are turning right so our uh, right uh, signal on complete stop here before the stop line uh, there is a pedestrian approaching from the left hand side i uh, just want to see which way um, you know uh, they're going okay so we just have to wait for the pedestrian to cross first and uh, after this um, you know this stop sign it's a one-way stop sign so that means it's only for us so now we're gonna creep forward and uh, then we check traffic okay so there is a uh, traffic approaching from the left hand side so we're just gonna wait for this traffic to clear first right shoulder check my right um, blind spot is clear so now we are good to go from this traffic light we are uh, going straight so light is green but uh, there is uh, you know it can change any second because there's an uh, orange hand uh, when you're going through the intersection make sure you're uh, scanning intersections as well um, on the next uh, traffic lights uh, we're gonna be turning right so on the right hand side uh, we have a bicycle lane and um, on this uh, intersection we are uh, going to turn right so i'm going to uh, signal right right shoulder check and i'm just gonna move my car closer to the curb and uh, maintaining distance uh, from this uh, bus so when you're waiting for the light to turn green um you can uh, you know look at the intersection just try uh, try to uh, you know get all the information that you need for example like on this intersection um there's no uh, you know prohibited sign so that means you are allowed to turn right on a red light so right uh, shoulder check again looks clear and uh, now we are uh, good to go and we are turning in the right hand lane first now we see a speed limit sign it shows a uh, maximum 60 kilometers um, on the next intersection we're going to be uh, turning left so i'm going to uh, signal left mirror check shoulder check and then we switch lanes and now we can cancel our signal when uh, when i get closer to the intersection then i will put the signal back on so now i can signal again and um, left uh, shoulder check again so we go in the left uh, turning lane so on this intersection uh, we have a separate signal for the left hand turn so looking in my rear view mirror light is red so we 
come to a complete stop behind the stop line. So you can see, um, you know, the traffic lights on the left hand side, um, right? So they are for the left hand turn and it says uh, left turn signal. So I'm going to focus on those on traffic lights because they are for me. Uh, the traffic lights on the right hand side over there, um, they are for uh, traffic going straight or traffic turning right. So uh, when the light on screen, uh, right, so I have to uh, check the intersection, make sure, make sure the cross traffic has stopped and now we are good to go. Uh, you also want to look for uh, pedestrians. Um, pedestrians, uh, you know, when you have that um, turning signal, they should not be crossing, but uh, sometimes they, you know, they are not paying attention, so they will start crossing. Uh, so you always be, uh, always be uh, careful. Um, scanning intersection here and uh, looking in my rear view mirror bicycle lane on the right hand side uh, stop sign is coming up and uh, we are going to turn right on the stop sign so i'm going to uh, signal right slowing down right uh, shoulder check and uh, going closer to the right hand side complete stop this is always stop sign now we are good to go blind spot check again looks clear and now we are good to go are you going for your g2 or g test Check out Truby Car's YouTube channel. Free driver education to help you ace your driving test. Truby Cars.